Hello everyone. Welcome to the video. In this video, I will show you the detailed features of Zoho MailChimp integration. It includes the installation of MailChimp integration for Zoho CRM from the marketplace and how it works. Come on let's begin. The Zoho MailChimp integration effectively syncs your customer records bidirectionally and you can save your time and eliminate the effort spent in dual data entry. Okay, let's start the installation of the Zoho MailChimp extension. First, log into your Zoho account with your email ID and password. On the Zoho homepage, go to Settings. Now search for Zoho Marketplace. Select All. Here search for the app MailChimp extension for Zoho CRM. You can start a free trial or you can buy the extension directly. The purchase plan has a monthly or yearly subscription. You can check out this by selecting the pricing option. I will go for the free trial installation, which is free for 15 days. Click on Start Free Trial. Tick the checkboxes by accepting the terms of service and privacy policy. And click on Continue. To give authorization for MailChimp, tick the checkboxes and click on Continue to install. Here you can use any user slash profile. I choose to install it for admins only. And then click on Continue. Now the extension is preparing to be installed. The Zoho MailChimp integration was installed successfully. Now select MailChimp from the menu. Click on the Connect button given for MailChimp to connect MailChimp with the extension. It will display a login window. If you don't have a MailChimp account, create one and come back to the installation. Otherwise, if you have a MailChimp account login with your mail ID and password. Now click on Allow to authorize the Zoho integration. The extension is successfully configured with my MailChimp. This section gets disabled automatically once you connect with MailChimp. Now connect the Zoho CRM with the extension. For that click on Authorize in the Zoho section. By clicking on Accept, you allow MailChimp to access data in Zoho CRM. Now click on the Next button. Read the terms and conditions carefully and click on Accept. We have successfully installed the MailChimp integration for Zoho CRM. Here you can see the MailChimp extension includes the dashboard, sync, lists, and logs. Each tab is interlinked with one another. Let us see them one by one. First, we go for Settings. As soon as the installation is completed, you will move to the configuration. Click on Edit to modify the settings. You can enable slash disable sync contacts, sync leads, and sync accounts. If you enable sync leads, Zoho CRM leads will sync as subscribers in MailChimp. That is Zoho CRM fetches the leads from Zoho Forms or Google Forms and then syncs it with MailChimp. Here I enable sync leads, contacts, and accounts. So all the records of my leads, contacts, and accounts will be synced as subscribers in MailChimp. Enable retrieve data from MailChimp if the record is deleted in CRM. It is to get back your data from MailChimp if it is deleted in CRM. Set the default module to sync all your records only as contacts, leads, or accounts. All your records will only be synced on the selected default module. Enable Sync Campaign and the members who received it to sync the MailChimp campaigns to Zoho CRM with an email list. Enable slash disable the allow sync MailChimp record with Zoho to sync the records from Zoho to MailChimp. Enable allow sync to MailChimp when the record is created or updated in Zoho to automatically sync whenever the record is created or edited inside Zoho CRM to your MailChimp account. This is how we set up the MailChimp extension for the configuration. If you want to sync the data with another MailChimp account, click on the reset MailChimp icon. It will delete your audience lists, but won't affect the contacts that you have synced. First we will see about Dashboard. The Dashboard provides you with all the details about your contacts. All the information in the Dashboard is customizable, so you can instantly check the details of a campaign. Check the list growth of your audience and preview your campaign. Here it shows the campaign details. As we didn't sync any campaigns. It shows, no campaigns are present in the Zoho CRM. And this is the list growth, which will show the status of the lists. We will check this after syncing lists. 
Now we will move to record sync. That is how the MailChimp integration works. For synchronization, go to the sync tab. Now click on the get list for MailChimp. This will get the list that you have created in MailChimp. Click on get campaign from MailChimp. This will get the campaign from MailChimp. Click on the sync icon. It shows the campaign synced successfully. As we already said once the list and campaign are synced it will be updated on the dashboard. So we will check it on the dashboard. Here you can see the campaign information and the list growth is updated on the dashboard. Now let's check it out on the campaign modules of Zoho CRM. Click on the menu and select a campaign. Here the campaign from MailChimp is synced to the Zoho CRM. Next, we move to the list sync. Now we can sync subscribers. On MailChimp, I have created a new subscriber by clicking on Add Contact and selecting Add Subscribers from the drop-down. Fill in all the required information. Click on Save. The new subscriber is updated in the MailChimp account. Now come back to the Sync tab and click on Sync Subscribers. Here, let us check whether the subscriber has synced to Zoho CRM. Click on Contact. Here you can see it was successfully synced. So far, we have learned the contact sync from MailChimp to Zoho CRM. As the extension syncs bidirectionally, you can also sync records from Zoho CRM to MailChimp. Let's see how it is. First, select any one contact from Zoho CRM and go to the detailed view of that contact. Click on the Send to Chimp icon on the top. This contact will be synced to MailChimp. Now we will check it on MailChimp. Click on All Contacts. By refreshing MailChimp, the newly synced contact will be updated in the lists. Next, we will see about sync via lists. For that, click on the List tab from the left side menu. Here you can view all your list's details. To view the complete details of a particular list, click on the eye icon. In the list section, you can add groups, tags, segments, and webhooks. Let us add them one by one. First, we add a group by clicking on Add Groups. For this, you have to give a group name, form fields, and group category. Finally, click on Save. Now your group has been added to the lists. To add a tag, click on Add Tag. And assign the tags for your lists. Likewise, you can add segments by clicking on Add Segments. Here you need to fill in the segment name. Then select the contacts match as any or all from the drop down. And you can give any conditions that will check and confirm based on the contacts match. You can also add more than one condition by clicking on the tab Add Conditions. Finally, click on Save. Next, we will add webhooks. For that, click on Add Webhooks. You need to give the valid callback URL. It is a mandatory field. Then there is a question, what types of updates do we send? Select the checkboxes as per your need. It is the list growth history that shows the updated records of the lists. Now you can edit or delete your record and sync all the changes you have made on a particular list just by clicking send changes to MailChimp. Then the changes will be updated automatically on your MailChimp. You can also sync the default Zoho tag of any contacts to the MailChimp subscribers. Let's check it out on MailChimp. Click on Tags. Here is the newly created tag that has synced from Zoho CRM. Then go for the Segments tab. The segments we have created on Zoho CRM have been successfully synced on MailChimp. These are the overall records that have synced on MailChimp. It shows the subscribed and unsubscribed status of the contact and also shows the tag related to the contact. Here you can filter the contact by means of tags. You can also add or remove any contact from the group by selecting any of the contacts and clicking on Actions. By this, you can add, remove, subscribe, and unsubscribe any contacts. You can also bulk subscribe and bulk unsubscribe existing records in Zoho CRM with the advanced feature. This feature is specially designed for the new user of our extension, who all have bulk records in your Zoho CRM and want to convert them into their MailChimp subscribers with a single click. Here you can see the related contacts, accounts, and leads. 
I have selected Related Contact because I chose my contact module as the default module in Settings. So that all of my MailChimp subscribers will be synced to the Contacts module of my Zoho CRM. Here click on the icon Bulk Subscribe Contacts. Now all your Zoho contacts will list it here. Here you can select the number of entries per page, based on your convenience. You can select all contacts or select any particular contact from the list to subscribe. You can search for any contact here with the help of a search bar. So that you don't need to scroll and search for any particular contact you want to add as a subscriber. Once you selected all the records, click on Relate Record. Now all of your Zoho contacts will be added as your MailChimp subscribers in a single click. Likewise, you can unsubscribe bulk records directly from your Zoho CRM. For that, select the contact that you want to unsubscribe from the list. Like bulk subscribe, you can select any number of subscribers or search it by name. Once selected, click on the bulk unsubscribe button. With a single click, all of the selected contacts will be unrelated to the MailChimp list. And also, you can see the contact has changed to unsubscribed audience. With the email opt-out integration, you can easily unsubscribe from any individual record of MailChimp audiences from right inside your Zoho CRM. Select the desired contact or lead that you need to unsubscribe. On the detailed view, enable the email opt-out field. Then the corresponding MailChimp subscribers will be unsubscribed instantly. This enhances your control over subscriber management and eliminates unwanted emails to the contact. The next one is the campaign reports. The campaign reports are used to track the campaign activities of all the members involved from right inside the Zoho CRM. Get the insights overview of your audience growth such as click-through rate, open views, bounce rate, etc. from the comprehensive dashboard and campaign report. With MailChimp extension, you can also make use of the automatic CRON sync. The synchronization of records from MailChimp to Zoho CRM can be automatically done every 10 minutes by a cron. This is all about the bidirectional syncing of records from MailChimp to Zoho and vice versa. Then we go for an audit log. The log section shows the successful and unsuccessful syncs of the records. You can see the filter option at the top. This is useful for filtering the audit history of records synced between particular periods. Click on it. Choose from and to date. And click search. It will show the filtered results. Click the clear filters tab to remove the filters. At the end of the header, you can find a global search bar where you can search details based on columns. If you are searching for any particular list, then it will show the synced history of that list. That's all. This is all about the features of the MailChimp extension you need to know. Hope this video will be helpful. Thanks for watching.